It's Friday, August 20th. I'm Jeff Bacalar, and it's time to get loaded. A USB dongle can now jailbreak a PlayStation 3, or at least that's what's being claimed by hackers who are selling the device. Purportedly, the PS jailbreak, as they're calling it, will allow users to play copied games from the system's hard drive or even an external drive. In addition, the software allows users to run non-Sony approved software. The hackers claim it won't violate your warranty and you can actually pre-order it right now for $150. Trillion, the popular multiple service IM client, has finally released an Android beta app. Users can expect support from a broad range of IM services, tab chats, emoticons, and current users of Trillion can actually sync their Astra accounts for easy setup. The app is not yet available in the Android marketplace, but users can install Trillion if they have Android version 1.6 or higher and have enabled developer apps in their settings. BlackBerry App World 2.0 is now out of beta and available for users to install. The new BlackBerry App Store has simplified credit card and carrier billing with its new BlackBerry ID support. Apps will now be tied to your user account ID, so you'll be able to transfer them from one phone to another. There are also new super apps that RIM will feature, and apps can now be priced starting at $0.99, cents, which is down from $2.99. After yesterday's announcement of Facebook Places disclosed that the site had already been working with Foursquare behind the scenes, the social check-in site received more new user signups in a single day than ever before. While some anticipated the news would ultimately end Foursquare, the immediate reaction seems to contradict that. Those are your headlines for today. I'm Jeff Bacalar for CNET.com, and you've just been loaded.